Hollywood. La, 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 la. Okay, I'll spare you the rest. <laughs> hey, it's time for the Read the Stars video again, and now we're discussing the Oscars. Yes, today and all the way through till Sunday, we will be discussing the Oscars. Um, right now, I just put up an article about the night of the Oscars, what it's going to be like. Well, the moon will be in Capricorn, and for those of you who have been following your daily horoscope, you know that when the moon is in a certain sign, that's how it sets the mood. So everybody's going to be in a Capricorn kind of mood. And what does that mean? It means that it's going to be a little bit more mm, classy than usual. More about the class and less about, you know, how crazy can everybody be and say stupid things at random times and such. This is going to be a very kind of boring probably, but <laughs> and long as usual, but it's probably going to be a very staid and um, steady sort of presentation this year, so uh, be prepared for that. Um, and the elegance, though. I mean, a Capricorn will always bring elegance to the table, so there will be a lot of that. So the clothing, I'm predicting, is going to be a lot more along, you know, the simple lines and gorgeous colors rather than, you know, fancy, frilly, or see-through like they have been some, in some Oscars past. Um, the two hosts, we have Anne Hathaway and James Franco, great actors. How good will they be at MCs? They'll kind of be a little bit at each other. This was really interesting to me because of my love cast interest um, and how we can get two signs to get along better. They're both um, kind of motivated to uh, be a little bit more assertive than the normal individual. Um, Aries, that would be James, um, he would be a little bit more overt about it, while Anne is going to be a little bit, a little bit more demure about it, and, um, you know, sort of, I would imagine they're probably going to set up the thing where, like, um, you know, she is, uh, going to be saying all the smart and clever things, and he's going to look like a doofus or something like that. So, um, predictable, but interesting. And, um... I think it's going to be great, you know, they're going, they're two great actors, so it could be a lot of fun, and there'll be a lot of presenters in between, so that'll be fun too. Um, in terms of the audience, the audience is going to be favoring the sentimental one, so, you know, look for that with the winter, winners, and, um, ooh, did I slip and say winter? There, there's something in there about a winter movie, and I wonder about that movie, I have a feeling about it. But am I going to give you predictions right now? Uh-uh. I'm going to make you wait. <laughs> and day by day, I will have predictions for you to look at. And you can make some of your own, too. So if you have any comments about what you think the Oscars are going to be like, write back at me. Okay? You can put a comment at the bottom of the video here or send me an email. Judy, J-U-D-I, at readthestars.com.